Well, it depends. Pilots, uh, they must uh, have very good eyesight uh, and uh, have the capability to uh, piloting the ship in the very uh, dangerous cases. Uh, but for the pilot experts, it's, it's a different thing. Although he will also trained of the courses of piloting the ship, but uh, it is not his duty. So it is uh, today the criteria for selecting the astronauts has lowered uh, for the payload expert. You can be have a near sight eye. This also shows that the manned space uh, technology of the China is already very very practical. So the criteria can be lowered. It is possible uh, and it can be utilized for, uh, as we mentioned, uh, the payload experts who has not the capability uh, ability to pilot in the ship. Well, that's his uh, personal or uh, private choice, I believe. Uh, he, he can have maybe uh, one or two as a backup because he will stay in the orbit for uh, five months. Uh, so maybe one or two uh, backup eyeglasses is necessary for him. You don't need to worry about if, if the glasses will flow away because you know that uh, we uh, wear our glasses and it is fixed and it will not flow. You can wear your contact uh, uh, glasses in, in the, uh, when you are in orbit, uh, but not in the uh, sending and uh, re-entry phase. Also, you know that as, as I've mentioned, the G-forces act on your body, uh, and this will uh, be not very safe on your eyes. So, but when you are already in orbit, you, you can do that.